Hey guys, it's Shifty here and I'm with my friend Ara. Hey guys, it's Ara here. And today we're gonna climb. No, 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 we're not climbing. We're trekking the famous Mount Pinatubo. Hey guys! Where we ride the 4x4 four four to go to the... Yeah. What's this? President of... Is this is a waiver that even if you die... No, it's your fault. Just need your autograph. My autograph! Of course! I'm gonna read because everyone... My mom told me that when you read us... Yeah, without reading, so... I like my acknowledge. Whatever accident or end... Okay. Okay, okay. Wow, the sky is getting blue, guys. So, it's actually not a very complicated journey. It's just you take the ATV one hour, and then you hike, I mean, you trek one hour, and then come back. Very See, this is how we look now. <laughs> Tanai Rizal, right? I think Tanai Rizal track was even harder. It will be even harder than this. Oh my god! We go with the ATV first, right? Yeah, and then the 7 kilometer trek. The, 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 the trek is 7 kilometers? Yes. To the crater. They said the trek is 1 hour. Yeah, so it's 7 kilometers. How can 7 kilometers be 1 hour? Let's <laughs> go, Jessica. Wait, 7 kilometers? That's a lot. That's a lot. It's actually not a very complicated trek. I thought it was some like 2 kilometer trek. <laughs> 2 kilometers is already a lot for me. <laughs> So here we begin our one hour off-road journey. And this was for sure one of the best parts of the tour. The scenic views you get to see on the way to the trekking start point. So here we are at our first stop point, Toblerone Hill. Of course, we can't miss the picture time. And I have to say, being here really made me crave Toblerone. Okay guys, so that was the Toblerone Hill. And now back to off-road. That's where the Aitas are living at. Yung mga bahay ni Aitas. So this is the beginning, guys, of our seven-kilometer trek. As of now, the road is fine, but let's see how tough it gets. It's much of a bigger scale than Tanay Rizal. Now the real journey to the Crater Lake begins. Guys, that view is such a, such a painting-like view. And literally in this vast space, it's just the three of us. 
Because we're the first one! Guys, it's such an exciting thing to be the first one in something, right? But it's not like every day where you get to be the first one in something. Almost like one in a lifetime experience, so... One of the best joys of traveling in the Philippines or living in the Philippines is getting to travel. How many kilometers are we? How many kilometers? 1.2. 1 1.2? 1 beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> 20 minutes later. Yeah, gave me this bamboo stick. Very nice. I love it. Guys, this is not that easy. Well, it's just getting water from the streams. That's fresh water? Yeah. Can I try it? Yeah. It tastes like uh, expensive water. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fast, fast? Oh yes! We're fast though. Competitive. Yes! This is really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Energized after having a quick snack and rest, we continued to trek till we reached the stop point where some of the Aitas, living in the mountain, were doing their laundry. Guys, this is the one I saw where it's like, during February, the 4x4 comes all the way here and all you have to do is just 2.5 kilometer trek, but during this season, it's 7 kilometers trek. Oh, but Ara, we're only 2.5 kilometers away now. Alright guys, the sun has come! But for the first time. It's so pretty. Oh wow. Wow. So we just got caught up. They're coming now in the back. Oh no! You know, our dream of entering the crater lake. We're the first one to enter there. We're gonna enjoy the crater lake without anyone! I'm alone here! I'm alone here! Because we're the first one! It might not come true, so we have to hurry. After going through some more green pathways, we finally reached the last stop point before heading to our final destination, the crater lake. From here, the road got quite slippery, so we had to be careful not to slip. Hi, Kuya. Go ahead. Kuya! They're already So the Kuya forest rangers are going ahead. That's fine. A few more steps. Yona! Oh my god! And now, guys, it's the moment. Wow. Big reveal. Bow wow! Yeah, this one, guys, you guys saw, right? They really, like, everyone came, all the seven kilometers is very precious. I'm feeling bulalo, this one, this one, I want this one. Makano ko yaisa. This one, hundred. And I like how it's, it's still, though, it's more fun in the Philippines slogan, guys. It's not the law of Philippines yet. Diba? Me too, me too. Yeah, I like this one. First snack, egg from 7-Eleven, 17 pesos per piece, like 9.30. Mm. That's good. It's very chewy and 
It's like smoked. Yeah, it's different, right? It tastes exactly like the Bekpan Sokkeran in Jim Jibang. The fee that we pay here goes to the Aitas. Mm. I recommend 7 Eleven boiled eggs, guys. Pomelo, what we got from SM. We're finishing all the food so that they don't have to bring anything. Tech snack. Jerk. So close. Beef jerky. All right, guys, so this is the precious, very, very precious, and this is very, very, very precious. Like seven kilometers, they walked up with this amazing view of Mount Pinatubo, Lucky Me Go Cup. By the way, guys, my first ever commercial film in the Philippines was this Lucky Me Go Cup. Work as well. Oh, people don't. Yeah, I was grilling it with a lot of passion. Like, you know, it, that smells good, huh? One time. Egg. Actually, my favorite one to have is the, the, the cup noodle one, you know, the cup noodle beef. Usually, like, if I heard, like, Lucky me go 100! But then, no. guys, I saw them carry it out. So even if it was, like, 150, I would pay for it. So those forest ranger who has come here every day. Look at them, look at them. Look at him. Look at wait. Look at him. So yeah, that's that one. So yeah, I should <laughs> cherish it. Hello. But you know what, Ara, that bathroom? When I stand up, I can see everyone. <laughs> hey guys, you are now riding Ara's back. <laughs> can we rest one minute? On the way back, we met some of the Aita kids again. So I shared some merienda I had with me and had a little chit chat. And now we have arrived to the ATV base to go back. So it turns out that the 7 kilometer trek had an elevation of 998 meters. So no wonder why guys, the journey on the way back was way easier and faster. Alright guys, I just arrived back to where we started. I was taking a 50 pesos flower and I'm gonna go to the 10 pesos CR. And we're gonna go back to our hotel first then. Drive back to Manila! Wow guys, what a timing! It's raining once we are going home! And on the way to Manila, I had to stop by Jollibee for the chicken which I've been craving since my trip on the way of coming here. Watch the first part of this video to understand the context. Alright guys, so that was another unforgettable trip I had here in the Philippines. The Philippine nature indeed has so much to offer. It has healing powers. So I hope you guys add Mount Pinatubo as well in your travel destination list. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!